<laughs> Take two. Your turn. Try. Hi y'all. Welcome back to Cammy's Kitchen. Today we're going to be doing chocolate chip banana muffins. And this recipe I found on Pinterest. And it's actually, the recipe is actually chocolate chip banana bread. Um, but I'm going to be making the muffins. So, let's get started on the ingredients that you'll need. Which are, of course, bananas. Nice and ripe bananas. Make sure that they are mashed, okay? You're gonna need butter. <laughs> Let's try. Okay. So, brown sugar, vanilla extract, sour cream, yes, sour cream, two eggs, flour, Baking soda, salt, and of course, chocolate chips. And the recipe calls for mini chocolate chips, but why? We use the big ones. Okay, so I'm gonna get started mixing my wet ingredients, and then I'll do the dry, and then I'll incorporate them, and go from there. Okay, so, of course, the mashed bananas. about, um, I believe it calls for one third cup of mashed bananas. I might have just a little bit more than that in there because we, you know, of course, like the taste of the bananas. And like I said, the uh, chocolate chips calls for a um, cup of the mini, but we like the larger, so. Um, okay, and it is a half a cup of butter, which of course is your stick of butter. And let's see, two eggs. Of course, I said two eggs. Mix those together. <clears throat> Then there is two tablespoons of um, the vanilla extract. And if you don't have vanilla extract, I know you can substitute it for um, maple syrup or even pancake syrup. So um, we had to run out to get eggs, so I also got some vanilla extract. Um, a half a cup, this is a half a cup of sour cream. And then mixing in. Okay, so your oven should be set for 350. So I am gonna go ahead and do that real quick. ingredients actually they did want the brown sugar and that is three-fourths cup of brown sugar and you can put that in your wet ingredients put the um, fourth teaspoon of um, salt in. So there's that. And there's one, two teaspoons of the baking soda. Okay. And two cups of flour. the dry ingredients there a little bit. Okay, go ahead and put 
those in. Mix that in with my wet ingredients. And I'm just using this little spoon. I haven't switched it out, but it's okay. It all makes the same spoon as a spoon. Okay. <clears throat> now once you get this mixed really well, then you can go ahead incorporate the chocolate chips in. It's just easier to pull them out with. Okay. Scooper. Okay. So when I say fill them kind of halfway, and then we will, um, I'll show you what they look like at the end. Sorry, you can't taste test them. They're going to be yummy. But, you just go ahead and make them yourself so that you can find out just how good they are. <laughs> you want to stay over there? My goodness. <laughs> are you okay? No. <laughs> oh, drink your water. <coughs> drink your water is difficult sometimes. <laughs> going to have enough to put more into the oven so we're going to have a lot of chocolate chip banana muffins just good because you can always freeze them um you know if you don't eat them and you want to have them later on so okay so these are filled i'm going to go ahead and pop them in the oven and then when they come out, I'll let you guys see what they look like, okay? Okay guys, so this is the finished product of the chocolate chip banana muffin. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button. If you'd like to see more, hit the subscribe button. It's free, guys. 
and uh, hit the bell notification so you'll get notified every time that I upload a new video. I hope that you guys have a blessed afternoon, evening, or day, wherever you may be. I hope it's blessed, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.